Hey everyone, this is Angel from Alex Gaming with a brand new video for Returnal and welcome to the fifth stop in Atropos, the Fracture Wastes. Here I'm going to show you all the hostiles and fauna that you will find in the fifth biome and how you can counter each and every one of them so you can have a better chance to survive. I do recommend that you take a look at my biome 2 and biome 3 survival guides up here on the YouTube card or in the playlist at the end of the video because the core movements of almost all of these enemies remain untouched so I'll just go over the slight changes for each one of them for this particular biome. In case you need them, there are timestamps in the description of the video and you to play as well for each enemy. Let's start with our first enemy, the last turret variant, the Frost Turret. Thankfully, this is the easiest turret of them all. It will shoot three spikes that freeze the ground beneath you to slow you down. After one second, you will notice each frosting circle has a light circle that shrinks to the center. When it reaches it, there will be a faint explosion that can damage you. Obviously, the only thing you need to do is keep moving to make sure you are never inside the circle and just heal the turret whichever way you want. Moving on to the Frost Drone. This is a variant of the Biome 3 Deadly Drone, but I think this version is not that annoying. It will only have two different attacks, the Missile Barrage that you already know, and this weird and very slow beam that creates red rings on the floor. Just jump over or dash through and you are good to go. The situation can get a little bit complicated if you find a lot of them together, where I would recommend to keep moving at all times and watch out for those rockets. Find cover whenever you can and use a big shot technique from my biome free video to take them one by one. Next on the list is the Frost Carveronix, very similar to the Carveronix from biome 2, but a lot easier to counter. This puppy only has two different attacks. If you get close, he will create three purple rings that you can easily jump and then counter. If you decide to get farther away, it will focus you with a laser, just like the turret from biome 4. Let him target you and wait until you see it raise its head and evade to avoid the laser beam. Then counter with a melee or with your gun. The next enemy is a Frost Machina, a different version of the biome free enemy, which I gotta be honest, it is still as dumb as the first one. There really isn't that much to say about this one because you're probably going to smash him to the ground before he has a chance to fire these balls that turn into red rings or its barrage of bullets. So just keep moving and shoot. Finally, we have the Frost Severed, an almost exact carbon copy of the Severed from Biome 2. Almost every single move is the same, except for this tiny little frost shot that freezes the ground beneath you to slow you down. That's it. Keep an eye on each one of its moves and be sure to check out the Biome 2 guide where I detail how to counter this bad boy. And those are all the enemies you will find in Biome 5 in Returnal. Don't forget to check out the Returnal playlist right here for more useful guides, but for now, I hope this was useful, thank you for watching and keep enjoying the game.